Hey everybody, topic is how I recover from doing uh, 20 hours of editing work. Now, food is a part of it, just like with the recovery after a physical workout. But this is different because this is not physical. It's a little physical, but it's mental. Now, I won't even be able to do this much editing work if I sat at a desk like most people. Yeah, that's not natural. Just doing this kind of work is, is not natural. Stay hydrated. So I'll get to food in a minute. But there's, there's more to recovery, more to health than food. The first thing you want to do, and you want to do this even during work, you want to take breaks and massage the neck, Shoulders lightly. Lightly. This is good. Because tension is going to build up, especially the more stress there is. Mind and body is connected. It's amazing people don't think it is. Some people, even experts. Uh, mental stress turns into physical tension. We all know this, don't we? Oh, I know it. Well, not everybody has a stressful personality. Anyway, uh, after after work, you actually want to see this is different from after a workout. After working, mental work at a desk, you want to actually do physical activity. You want to use the big muscles because you know, you're in a vulnerable position where you could injure yourself. You know, Sprains can happen. So use the big muscles, like squats. Yeah, put, put the keyboard aside here. Bring in the fruit. But you want to exercise first. You don't want to eat while you're stressed out. Some, some people just go right to the food as comfort. Yeah, Trisha Paytas mentioned. There's no vegan comfort food. That's I think she's just trying to get us to comment. <laughs> yes. Just use the big muscles. And slow is good. It helps get out the tension. And it's safer. Exercise slow. No need to do it fast. Also, taking a warm bath or a shower is good. And massage all over the place. Arm strings, backs everywhere. Oh yeah, your wrists. Oh, and hand massage. Yeah, you got nerves in the hands, just like the feet, that connect to all over the body. And massaging your fingers. I found a real efficient way of doing it because I don't have time. <laughs> That's why I'm so stressed. <laughs> Irony. So, all eight fingers at the same time, massaging them. And we're done. Scratching the palms. Okay, so so that's you know, physical rejuvenation and mental. Oh, and you also want to listen to my relaxation video, which you should be doing almost every day. I'll put a link up here. Another thing I want to demonstrate. This will take 15 seconds, then we'll get to the food. The tense and relax technique. Here's how it's done. Tense up the body part. I will do the neck and shoulders. Take a few seconds to tense up, slowly tense the muscles. Go halfway towards the maximum. Hold it for seven seconds. And then slowly let go, taking another four, four seconds to relax completely 
and then let it go completely. And you can feel it. There's a big difference. And then do that with all body parts. And of course, actually, we take a rest, like I was doing there. Ten, ten minutes helps to actually get under the covers. Yeah. And it's, it's, it's all, it's, it's a different feel. It even affects the mind. For food, you don't want to just go to the fat like people want to do. Heavy, heavy foods. You want to start off light. The easiest food to digest and something that's going to get into your bloodstream really quick. And, and the stuff that should be getting into your bloodstream really quick. Vitamin C, great for recovery. And I'm only juicing so I can get this lemon in, because I got a lemon tree. Once this is gone, then I just start eating again. Uh, lots of good stuff for recovery. And the, the white part of citrus fruits, first time mentioning this, yeah, almost nobody bothers talking about this. There's too much drama going on. When you eat the fiber of an orange, there's a little bit of weight there. But most of it's on, on the peel. That stuff. You want to eat some of that off there. That's called the pith of the orange. And there's vitamin P in there. Have you ever even heard of vitamin P? That's good for recovery of the cells. Plenty of minerals in there. Don't forget those. Essential. Essential. You want to chew your juice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll eat this. Then a half hour later, more water. A lot of it. Then, then we'll eat some heavier food. You want to get the calories in. Sure, I mentioned eating light at first. Easy food to digest, but you still got to get the calories. There's no making up for calories. There's no substitute for calories. There's a lot of people under eating on purpose. <laughs> Did you, have you noticed that in the last week? And I'll probably be back tomorrow with another video. I got a lot of good stuff.